Hello and welcome to Virtual Crafts. In this video, we'll see how we can create multi step forms in WordPress. I already created a video on how we can create single step forms. To watch that video, you'll find the link in description or you can click the card above. Now, why do we need multi step forms if the same thing can be achieved from single step forms? While forms are the most basic and easiest way to collect data and user information, it can sometimes come across as boring or tedious. So, if your site is using long forms, never make a first bad impression by using very lengthy single step forms it will straight away lead you to form abandonment and that means you'll just lose a subscriber when someone visits your site and he sees a very lengthy form asking for information the chances are he'll just close the tab and move on now what can we do to avoid these form abandonments we can split or divide our long single step forms into multi steps and show that visitor one step at a time now this thing has more benefits than one can think of. Studies show that multi-step forms have 14% higher conversion rate than single step forms. The first thing is that it makes a lengthy form more interesting and appealing to the users who are filling them out. And another main benefit is the engagement you get from your users, which surely affects your site in a positive way. Now it's a natural tendency that we try to collect a lot of information from users and the users on the other side want to get access to the goal spending as little time and effort as possible while filling out the forms. So instead of monotonous and lengthy forms, one can keep things short and interesting by dividing it to various sections or pages. And that's what we'll see in this video that how we can create multi-step forms to attract more visitors and to increase the conversion rate of our websites. Go to your WordPress dashboard. We'll have to install a plugin go to plugins add new we already have worked on this plugin it's WP forms I'll upload it from my computer and then click install now now the installation wizard is in progress Activate this plugin. Now this is the welcome screen for WP Forms. Click this button, create your first form. Here are some templates for the forms. You can start from any of these. I'll choose blank form for now. We don't have any fields yet. Let's add our fields. I'll add name. Click on this field to edit it. In the advanced options, I'll change the field size from medium to large. Now add a new field. Email. And let's say we want the user to enter their phone number and their address. And let's say we want them to provide some information about their portfolio which will be a website URL and a file which may be a CV and at last we can ask them for a message so we'll add a paragraph text so let's edit these fields quickly I'll change the size of all of these to large to align them asynchronously In this form you can choose the address scheme from US to international and now it will add a country field too. Ok let's say we want only these fields for now. Now how we can make this form a multi step form. Go to add fields tab and you have a field here page break. Now let's say in the first step we only want a visitor to enter their name. So add a page break after the name field. Click this page break section and give a title to this page. I'll have it say your name. Now let's say that in the second step we want the visitor to only fill their contact information. So let's say add a page break after these. Give this page a title. I'll go for contact information. 
and in the third step we can ask for their address add a page break after the address field and give it a title now in the next step we are asking our visitor to enter their portfolio information add a page break after these two fields give it a title portfolio and our last step will be the message now give a title to this page your message okay now every step has a next button but what if the visitor wants to go to previous step we need to have a previous button too click on this page break field and toggle this setting display previous and now you'll see a previous button has been added you can edit the text from here let's say I want it to say back and now it will say back I'll keep it on previous now do this for each section okay now we have five steps created we have given a title to each step we have set the next and previous buttons too now click this section first page and you will see the progress indicator options now it is set to progress bar change it to any progress indicator I will go for circles here you can change the color of the circles or your progress indicator bar let's see how this one looks and then we will change it again save your form click embed and copy this short code now visit your site go to contact us page and click edit with Elementor now search for the shortcut module add it to your content area and paste your short code here the form has been added to the site let's add a heading to this form click update and preview your page now you'll see the heading all the steps with their titles and the step which is currently active is colored green okay let's fill out the form and see uh, how the steps work enter your name and click next give your email choose your country for the phone number I'll go for Pakistan and enter my phone number I'll go for a random number and then click next ok now you'll see that the color has moved to the step which is active now enter your address click next give the website URL upload any file here click next and now enter a message you can always go to your previous step by clicking this button and then again to the next step your information will not be lost it will still be there ok now let's click submit and submit our form and now you'll see a success message that your form has been submitted so this is how you create appealing multi-step forms you can go for more customizations now let's change it to progress bar click save and visit your website now we'll have to go incognito because we've already submitted the form and go to contact us page 
now you'll see that the color has been changed to blue and we have this progress bar instead of those circles now go back and change it to connector and save it let's change the color to this time to pink go back to your incognito window and refresh the website and now you'll see a connector bar with the color changed I'll keep it to circles so that's how you can add multi-step forms to your website and this way you can attract more traffic and you can highly increase your conversion rate that's all for this video let me know if you face any problem if you like the video please subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to never miss the latest videos thank you and see you in the next video